What is up everyone, Oscar here with a new video. Before we get into it though, I'd like to remind you all to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and share this video, and turn on post notifications so that way you guys know when I drop a new video. And in this case, uh, today's video is going to be talking about Real Madrid's, po um, it's going to be my post-game reaction to Real Madrid versus Real Valladolid. Um... It was a Wednesday match, uh, a, a week, uh, a midweek game match. Uh, this is uh, in rare occurrences, so I know that you guys probably weren't expecting it, but that's how La Liga rolls sometimes. Sometimes, they, you know, they play. I know that they play on weekends, but here and there, just to, you know, uh, either wrap up their season early so that way they can play um, for their respective international um, sides. They, they like to... Um, you know, play throughout the week here and there. So this is one of those weeks. And uh, Real Madrid, you know, played today against Real um, Valladolid. And Real Madrid, uh, oh, man. So I got to give credit where credit is due. Um, Thibaut Courtois and Real Valladolid's um, goalkeepers, you know, were, were the uh, players of the game. And, you know... Real Madrid had a few, like, potential goals, and, like, I, you know, last um, last year, you know, Luka Jovic and, you know, all those um, young guys did not score for Real Madrid, you know, and I was, you know, I was kind of, when, again, the Champions League, when they decided to put in these young guys, I was like, why, you know, why, why put in these, you know, guys that didn't, didn't produce, but, you know, this compares to what they're doing now, you know. Um, Zinedine Zidane is actually, you know, putting in the young guys, giving them opportunities to, to play so that way they can get the experience and the necessary, you know, uh, the, the experience and, um, exposure, I, I was, I was going to say to play. And, you know, this is, this is what shows it because Luka Jovic played phenomenally today, my opinion, um, um, Modric played meh, let me see who else, um, you know, just, he, again, um, uh, Federico Valverde played great, you know, so, like, I, I really like that, you know, um, Zinedine Zidane, you know, has, has gone with the youth movement, but we just gotta get more goals, and that's what I've said, you know, time and time again, we just need to get goals, because these 1-0, 1-1, 2-1, you know, what have you, it's not going to get it done in La Liga, unfortunately, especially if Barcelona is going to be scoring four to five goals per game. You know, we're, we're trying to win La Liga for a second year in a row um, to show that we're not a flash in the plan. But, you know, you know, it's all around, you know, Real Madrid, um, you know, being able to, you know, get in, get in and, and be in, in that score, in that position to score goals was, was great. However, Real Valladolid, you know, made everything in their power to make Real Madrid uncomfortable. And um, they, they did have a lot of shots on goals as well. You know, hence the reason why I say Thibaut Courtois and their goalie, can't remember his name at, 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 the, time, at the present moment, but, um, you know, hence the reason why th those are the, the, the players of the game because, you know, if it wasn't for them, then, you know, either Real Madrid or it would have either been a, a tie, a win, or a loss for, for either team. So, you know, that is my, my, my biggest takeaway. Now, you know, who played really bad was uh, Karim Benzema. Not his best game, you know, and he's been off um, throughout the, you know, the first three, three four games. So we just got to get him back in, back in the sink. Um, I just can't wait to have a, you know, even though I, I'm like asking, you know, where are you at, Eden Hazard, you know, and again, I read it. Where are you, man? Because I would love, love, love to see Eden Hazard, uh, Martin Orlegard. Let me see who else. Uh, Karim Benzema, um, Valverde, and uh, this young guy. Oh, what's his name? Uh, just mentioned him earlier today, man. Uh, Luka Jovic, man. That that's gonna be you know that's that's a front. I really because I know that if those you know a combination of those players and we saw we saw you know glimpses of what Luka Jovic and um 
Karim Benzema can be together. You know, that was just, again, like, either, like, both sides were incredible. So, when, once and if we get that, you know, healthy Eden Hazard and the uh, Eden Hazard of Chelsea, and if he plays like he did in Chelsea, not this, you know, you know, rubbish guy that we got and didn't do jack squat this past season, I really... I'm looking forward to seeing him play with with um, Karim Benzema and um, Luka Jovic because that that that'll be a very you know interesting front three. But um, Vinicius Junior, shout out to him. Um, he was the one that scored the goal, and uh, it was a, a mistake by the you know hats off to to um, Vinicius who you know took advantage of a little mis mishap and mistake that Real uh, the Real Valladolid player did. Um, hence the reason why we got that goal. You know, he he played them off, um, played him, and then you know scored the goal. So you know, again, a one to zero. You know, nothing to you know celebrate. I'm just looking forward to seeing them grow from this experience. I know that the last few videos were me, you know, going ham on them, going to zero to zero, you know, zero zero draw, you know, um, you know, three to two with you know VAR and them like. Uh, helping the the refs and and VAR helping them, but you know this this game, yes, there's room for improvement. I just think that they should improve their their touches on the goals. You know, um, get getting Benzema back back in back into the game. Um, again, not not himself the last few weeks. Um, hopefully we can get a healthy um, Eden Hazard, um, and so that he he can contribute because I I loved what I saw from Luka Jovic today along with Federico Valverde and, and them. So, uh, again, a very good win. Um, could have been a draw, to be honest, with the way that Real Valle leads goalie was playing. But, again, uh, it could have been a draw. It could have been, you know, a, a win for either team. But Real Madrid snuck out of there with a win. 1-0 to zero was your final. All right, guys, um, that is it for my analysis of this game. Um, going to... Re- Post a video tomorrow talking about the Washington football team's um, game against the Ravens a lot. And then, um, so that, that is up for, that is all for the, for the midweek portion. Again, I will go live throughout the weekend. Um, my main concern is, again, I think I believe Sunday is another one of those, you know, double game, you know, me watching both games at the same time. I just need to double check on that. I may be wrong. But, um, you guys will definitely get videos regarding both Washington and Real Madrid. So that is a guarantee. So already then guys, I will see you guys next time. Peace.